Hi, if you're like me, you know The Likely Lads 1964 is one of the best sitcoms of all time. So today, I thought it would be fun to pull up a chair by the campfire and rewatch the sitcom with the entire cast of Then and Now. I will tell you about the original names and ages of the actors and how they have changed in 2023. Okay, let's see. Nesbitt is played back to Michael Schurt. In 1965, when he was in the sitcom, he was 27 years old, and sadly on August 31st, 2005, he passed away 67 in Isle of Wight, England. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Who's this, Judith? Your latest protege? Uh, Bob's just started working in the drawing office. How exciting. What she went over there because, um, the Mind of Evil was a, a lovely story to do. And Archie is played back to Norman Chapel. In 1965, when he was in the sitcom, he was 40 years old, and sadly on July 21st, 1983, he passed away at 57 in England. We do do a simulated mock Michelangelo design that goes very nice with a lighter wood, very tasteful together. Did you, um, deal with... 5.30? That's very early, is Yeah, I know. I got a plane to catch. But I normally get my head down about then. It's the middle of the night, you know. Bob Ferris is played back to Rodney Booz. In 1964, when he was in the sitcom, he was 27 years old, and sadly on November 21st, 2017, he passed away 79 in Cageworth, Cornwall, England. E. Valerie Monk. <laughs> that takes you back. She was a right old boot. <laughs> and it's such a good deal. I hate missing it. I missed it one year, and I wish I hadn't because it came down. But uh, this year I'm going to do it. Angela is played by actress Juana Ventham. In 1965, when she was in the sitcom, she was 30 years old, and now she is living out there at 88. Hubert Marlowe. Marlowe? No, I can't say that Doctor I... Dr. Hubert Marlowe. Doctor? Oh, I'm afraid we only accept rare women here. When he was working, because I can remember the, um, the first assistant coming up to knock on my bedroom door at 1 and 2 in the morning saying, could you get here? Terry Collier is played by actor James Bolam. In 1964, when he acted in the sitcom, he was 29 years old, and now he's living out there at 88. Love for me! <laughs> Hilarious! How would you believe it? Hey, love mind, love. And the immediate response you get from something, and in the theatre, hopefully you can't, when you're all in and the, the lights go down, and it's... Uh, Mario is played by actor George Layton. In 1965, when he was in the sitcom, he was 22 years old, and now he's living out at 80. Hey. Oh. Well, what are you talking about, Phil? This is a pub, isn't it? Pub to you and me. I've been an actor, what, I suppose, best part of five, six, maybe seven years. I've been out of drama school and... I've done a bit of telly, but it was a, a cachet for me to be in Doctor Who and clear. Pat is played by actress Susan Jameson. In 1964, when she was in the sitcom, she was 23 years old, and now she's living out there at 82. Who is he? He took me now. Why not? He was just looking, that's all. Oh. Oh, it's all right now. So it was. So, you know, that's what happened with these, some of these guys who, you know, moved up politically. So, uh, no, it was good. It's good. But uh, Mr. Chloe is played by actor Bartlett Mullins. In 1964, when he was in the sitcom, he was 60 years old, and sadly on May 15, 1992, he passed away at 82 in Great Maplestead, Essex, England. Pen and pencil set. No, he loses it. He always loses things like that. Hey, well, you know what I was thinking? One of them little radios. The transistor? There won't be enough in there for that. Hey, tell you what's a good... Sheila Mills is played by actress Sandra Payne. In 1964, when she was in the sitcom, she was 20 years old, and now she's living out the 79. Mackenzie, can I get you a drink, tea, coffee, pina colada? No, thank you. That's <laughs> very kind of you, Mr. Trotter. Yes. May we, may we, Derek, please. Jack is played by actor Don McKillop. In 1964, when he was in the sitcom, he was 36 years old, and sadly on December 19, 2005, he passed away 77 in Spain. Terrorist, you know. 
jungle warfare. Our lads getting shot in the back, wading through swamps up to here with your rifle above your head. Mosquito. Parcher's playback to Jeffrey Hughes. In 1966, when he was in the sitcom, he was 22 years old, and sadly on July 2017, 2012, he passed away 68 in Isle of Wight, England. What are your ambitions for the future? Do you know, I love theatre. I haven't actually worked in the theatre for six years, so it's not really that long in terms of... Bob and his playback to John Scott Martin. In 1965, when he was in the sitcom, he was 39 years old, and sadly, on January 6, 2009, he passed away at 87 in Devon, England. Two school teachers. Yes. And so we went back to the same school with Sylvester. Elsie's playback actress Patricia Shakespeare. In 1964, when she was in the sitcom, she was 22 years old, and now she's living out at 81. Which character is your favorite in the sitcom The Likely Lads? And what do you think when some actors have passed away? Leave your comments below this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe to the channel, and ring the bell to wait for my next videos. Thank you and see you again.